So I thought it'd be cool to come down here and check out Townsend Park in New Brighton. I don't believe I've ever walked through this, maybe when I was way younger. But a uh, nice little park, got lots of benches, decorate for the holidays. Yeah, I figured it'd be something neat to just check out. Definitely never done this before, but I'm definitely up for it, you know. Got something to look at, happy holidays, nice flag up there. It's hard to read that. Because of the flight, the old flight covering it up. Yeah, you can put your kid's head in that or your adult head in that. <laughs> That's pretty neat. My kid would definitely love that if she was with me way too cold today, though. She stayed home with mommy. Erected in honor of Company B 10th for blah blah blah. Soldiers, a bunch of soldiers on there. Appreciate their service as always. Yeah, they definitely do well here. Like it. They decorate all around the edges, too. Just random benches everywhere. This would definitely be a nice place to come and read a book or watch TikToks in the summer. <laughs> TikTok. That's what we've come to now. <laughs> Let's just come and sit on a park bench and watch our uh, video clips. Or watch me on YouTube. Ha <laughs> ha. Citizens of New Brighton honor the men and women who served in the armed forces of the United States Army and the United States of America from 1940 to 1947. Oh, so this, was de this is definitely a memorial. All these names. That is a lot of names. Definitely appreciative of all, all these people. Lots of outlets for all the lights. And they even got icicles hanging up there. That's wild. This would be really neat at night. You can walk up there if you want to. I'm not going to because I'm already freezing. <laughs> I figured I'd just show every little aspect of this that I could before my hand froze. So unfortunately, I'm not a good left-handed uh, filmer. I don't know how many people... Oh, there's another one of those things. I don't know how many of you people uh, film with both hands, but I'm always better with right. I'm always more steady. New Brighton Honor Roll World War Veterans. Wow. 1917 and 1918. Very cool. Yeah, I like these little cutouts. <laughs> Maybe on a warmer day, I'll bring my kid down here and take some pictures for some memories. It's always nice to get those memories because they're really little for so long, you know? Didn't we see? Yeah, well, I don't think we saw that. Uh, let's get over here. Loving memory of Mayor Rick Smith. And there's a snowman there. More benches. Some little artillery there. Oh, there's even a trash can. Nice. So memory of those who died in service in 1917, 1918. Statue. Last but not least, the citizens of New Brighton rededicate this park to those who have served in the armed forces of the United States. Very nice little park. Hope you enjoyed watching. See you next time. Oh, there's another thing over here. Before we go, <laughs> this park give to the people of New Brighton by David Townsend. Oh, nice. Oh, there's another one, too. Can't forget everything. And it's on Mulberry Alley across from the Municipal Building in New Brighton. Beaver Division, blah, blah, blah. Two locks at Rochester 5 in New Brighton. And two at East from over Camden Falls, Beaver River. The canal was extended to the area in 1834. Canal traffic ceased in 1871. Few remains are visible today. Interesting. Never knew that. I don't know if you saw that. No animals are permitted during events. This is very nice. I am very impressed. They have done a great job. Whoever cares for this, very well done if you're seeing this video. I really like it here. As I said, thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Okay, bye.